No, Jed that. must be hosting some event. I wonder why he wants lilies, though. They're traditionally for funerals. Oh. God. I'm gonna walk up. They were for Gabe's wake. Gabe's wake? Oh, she's geeking hard, bro. What in the... <laughs> Bruh. I think it has something to, Me personally, if I'm being honest with you I genuinely think it has something to do with Ryan, bro That nigga's the only nigga I know that, Bro, I visibly seen the nigga cut the rope Like, he looked like he had like something out for him No nigga would just do that Doesn't matter Someone is putting pressure on him to keep quiet Someone from the mine and It doesn't matter Yo, Why are you getting all hostile behind it? You acting real suspicious He's really about dead, this, Alex. my boy So last time, Alex, Alex, she saved Ethan, right? As she went to going to save Ethan from that little, over that little, like, a hunt, I don't even know how long the fall was, like 10 foot, 50 foot, 100 foot. I don't know. She was over some big lake, right? Let me just say this. I don't know why he was trying to go up to the mountain. He saw it in his comics. Uh, I think Ethan has the same thing Alex got or something like that. Uh, auras, reading auras. <laughs> or, I don't know, Ethan might have something else. I think Ethan got something else, bro. He just got something else going on. I don't think he got reading orders like Alex did. But he got something else going on, and he sees a monster in, like, the lake. And she got inside, like, his mind and seen the same thing. All right, blah, blah, blah. Uh, boom, we save him, right? We go right back across the big log, right? We go right back across the big log. As we go right back across the big log, notice there was a sign that said something about uh blow blowing up eruption or something like that so something blew up a whole bunch of rocks started flying down the hill as rocks flying down the hill um gabe he got hit with a rock uh i was trying to save him come back up bro we were trying to pull the rope this nigga ryan gonna end up cutting the rope bro this nigga's a bad man i ain't gonna lie he a bad guy for that bro he a dangerous man he played a dangerous game there bro he forgot that gabe is alex's brother and alex just moved into a city that her brother knows more about than her so it's like my what are you doing? Are you forgetting that that that's family, nigga? Are you forgetting that, Ryan? In my personal opinion, that was just like idiotic, bro. Just roll out to the end of time. Let's get it, man. Let's go, y'all. Yeah. I, I, I love you, Jay. What Ryan did was just like straight dumb, bro. I don't even know why he did that BS. Chapter two, lanterns. I right, bet. Say that. I'm not big on speeches. I've always believed that the role of the bartender yeah. is to shut up and listen. This the funeral? And by that measure, Gabe was the worst bartender I've ever known. I never issued a speeding <coughs> ticket to someone on a bicycle before until he came along. I feel like I he cared something. so much about my admissions essay. Even though he probably couldn't spell admissions <laughs> or essay. <laughs> no for Never mind. I ain't even gonna start problems. He booked my band to play the lantern. All the way from Seattle to pretty much right where I'm standing. Gabe was a good dude, bro. I can recall 14 specific instances where Gabe said something that made me laugh. This wasn't supposed to happen, <laughs> bro. This wasn't supposed to happen. The first was two years ago. So, long story short, instead of a ticket, I ended up buying him a beer. <laughs> Gabe stood like three feet away. Grinning like a doofus at us. I'm sure there were more people. But I only remember him. And then he said, I know. That's why the K is silent. Then the fifth time. He cared about Alex everyone. He was the kind of guy you wanted to be around. He was a world-class bullshitter. True. He was my 
best RP, friend. Man, RP. Where Ryan and Alex at? That's what I want to know. All I want to say about Gabe is he came into this bar as a stranger, but he left it as family. Long live Gabe, man. <clears throat> Guess that's that then. What happened to Gabe was a senseless, tragic accident. And I just wish it that. It wasn't an accident. Nigga, you Son, cut it! Now is not the time. Gabe called the mine. I gave him my sat phone to be sure he could get through. They fucked up. And now, now Gabe's dead. That was my shift. If anyone had called, it would have gone through me. Nobody called. You're lying. <laughs> In front of Gabe's own fucking sister. Alex heard the whole thing. Uh, I guess? He's right. I was there when Gabe made the call. I, I guess? I'd like to hear what you have to say about that, Mac. I'm not saying anything. Just... I didn't get a call. Try your own conclusions. All right, folks. This is an ongoing investigation. How about that... we review the sequence of events? Hmm? Well, son. When I saw you at the record store, you seemed pretty eager to find Gabe. Remember why? Hmm? Another fight with Riley, maybe? No, I don't have to take this. Just saying. Pretty wild that you come stumbling out of Gabe's apartment with your face all fucked up. Right. And just a couple hours later, you just so happened to miss the call that would have saved his life. Look, I told you there was no call to miss. Hey, maybe the call got dropped. Oh shit, I mean, it's not like, it's not like Gabe was Mr. Reliable all the time. You watch your mouth, Mac. Ryan, that's enough. Now, I'm just as eager as you to understand all this, son, but there was a time- Bullshit, and... Dad. This little weasel's calling Gabe a liar at his own fucking wake. No, I am just telling you. Mac, I swear, if you say there was no call one more fucking time. Stop it! Stop oh, it fuck, now! Oh, fuck. Okay, all right, my bad. I didn't mean to instigate. This is not the time or place. <clears throat> We're all here for Gabe. Okay, yeah. Ryan? Sure, I'm... I'm sorry. It's not... I'm just trying. You good, bro. You you good, bro. It's completely understandable. I'm not the one who killed him. I mean. No! No! Aren't you though? What the fuck did you just say? Ryan, back off. Oh, I'm hell. just saying. I thought I heard that you were the one. You shut the hell up. No. I mean, no. I'm just saying though. Like, hey, hey, my nigga. You were the one that cut the, why, like, you didn't even try to pull him up. So, and, like, if anybody's really blaming, like, you cut it. Like, that was your choice. Like, you cut that, like, you know what I'm saying? Okay, he got smacked by the boulder, cool, but he still could have been alive, though. It don't mean he just offered to die. You cut that hoe now, bro. Now he in the, the ocean somewhere. Go ahead. You got something to say, Mac? Let's fucking hear Come it. Come on, guys. Don't make me intervene. All right. Fine. As long as we're tossing around accusations, way I hear it, you're the guy who cut the rope. That is a fact. I witness that. That whole phone call thing, you know, I don't really know too Why much about. Why not Wake's over. Everyone out. <laughs> she about to lose it. No King Carson shit. Alex? So what happens if a whole room is like arguing? Hey. Like, what happens? Fuck those guys. Yeah. That damn right. Are you okay? Uh, I, I, I will be. I ain't gonna lie. Not really, but I, I will be. It's not your job to keep it together. Thanks. Do you, um, it's messy, but do you want to come in? Sure. You play guitar? I mean, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit. Used to. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Well, Here and there. Sort of. High C note. I used to. Sometimes. Cool. Gabe would try to pop wheelies outside the record store to make me laugh. Never worked. Till he wiped out. Just, that was scene. hilarious. Gabe really wanted to do the LARP for Ethan. But by the end of it, he was more jazzed about it than anybody. The LARP. What Wish is, I could have seen it. Is that a play or something? What is, what is the LARP? Where does the LARP go? We took this a year ago. We... What happened? 
No way. What happened? Am I missing something? What's going I on? I can't. What? He actually kept it. Who's ball champ? Aww. What a dick. What aura are you feeling now, Alex? Sorry. I just need a minute. Yeah. Uh, no problem. Calm down, Alex. You're fine. You're fine. Breathe, nigga, breathe! Whatever that bottle made her think of, it really messed her up. I wonder if I could help her the same way I helped Ethan. I need to feel her sadness to figure out how to help her. Or reactivate it, nigga! What just happened? What just happened? Am I... Now I can find out what's really going on with Steph. How do? Ladies and gentlemen, presenting you your new foosball Jonathan? champion, Gabe Chen. Oh, you're the worst. Can't believe I have to stay in this stupid town. I think we both know you could have beat me if you really wanted to. So you're welcome. Bullshit. Y'all be playing, y'all play foosball before? I ain't gonna lie. I think I played that hoe one time. Like, what's the, bro, what's the dialect? Bro? What are they called again? Don't shit on my yard. They're amazing. Their guitarist has one arm. Badass. <laughs> Dude, give it up. I already booked a bus ticket. Wait, wait, hear me out. One more game. If I win, you have to stay. If you win, I'll cover the ticket. You just lost 50 bucks. Which way is this helping me out? How is it gonna help Steph out though? Steph? Sorry. This is so embarrassing. I just need some time. Okay. Uh, I mean, you're straight. Like, I know what you're doing. I see what you're going through. Like, right in front of me. How can I miss it? Here's to your new job at the station. Oh, didn't I tell you? I'm not taking it. I move to Denver next week. You what? I think I know enough to help her now. Still can't believe he's gone. Yeah. He's the whole reason. I'm absolutely still... the only one not sad. That's her own blood. I'm sorry, Alex. Don't mind me. Is a trivia question, Monica? How about a quick match? Did Gabe tell you Come we on. played? Come on. I see the foosball champion thing right there. Uh, yeah. He loved playing with yeah. you. Like, man, he, he talked about it. And he said time. he kicked your butt. <sighs> Asshole. I don't really think it's a great time. My gosh! What are you gonna do, soak? Fine. Yeah. First to five points. If you say so. Don't ma don't tell me they're gonna make. I don't even know how to play this hoe in real life. So how often did you and Gabe play? It was one of our favorite games. You must be pretty good then. Mm-hmm. I lose. Bitch. How uh, bitch. how long bitch. did you play with them? Bitch. <sighs> bitch. Too long. Bitch. 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 Gotcha. I'm about to be a spammy nigga. I'm what? Ah, oh, fuck. There we go. Bitch. 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 Yeah. Five points. Yeah. Game. Yep. Big shocker. Oh, hey, at least you played your best. I mean, that obviously wasn't my best. No. I get it. I mean, this is a tough game. You're some, you're just some shit. Requires just skill. Space. You shit. Tiny. You shitty. It's okay, though. And the will to be a champion. It's okay though. You're oh. running the blood. Is that how it is? Yeah. Wait, hold on. The crowd is really picking up on my energy. <laughs> we love you, Alex. Ah, <laughs> <Strip> sucks. <laughs> okay, fuck you. I want a rematch. 
<laughs> You're on. Life is strange is good, but bro, these corny dialogues begin me sometimes. I ain't gonna lie. You think? Certainly not. Ah! Greatest Northwest band of all time, go. <laughs> Are you trying to distract me? Bitch. Fuck, I'm pressing the wrong button! Fuck! Oh, yes! <laughs> Let's do one more game. I don't know. Oh, come on. You know Gabe would never let a tie stand. Oh, my. Yes, I don't give a damn. Well, settled. Don't look like Gabe to you, nigga. <laughs> this is it for all the marbles. No, I'm actually try hard now. Bro. I don't want to lose it again. Hey, so are you into girls or what? What? <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I'll date lie. anybody. Assuming they're my both? type. <laughs> What's your type? <laughs> I'll let you know when I meet them. Who's what? What did you say? What? Fuck. <laughs> I knew it. How old are you exactly? Old enough to know better. Plot thing is they start dating each other at the end. Bitch. What the fuck wrong with you? On the bit of the gang, on the fucking jet of the gang, damn it. On the fucking jet of the gang, damn it. On a fucking jail again, dummy! On a fucking jail again, stupid! Hey, you got that shit. I ain't gonna lie, you got that shit. Hit the hoe! Bitch. Yeah. Woo! Nigga! Foos, ball, champion! Foosball champion, goddamn <laughs> shit family. Oh, <laughs> good game. GG's, my nigga. GG's. Thanks, Alex. GG's. I'm really glad you talked me into it. It was a lot of fun. Of course. All right, can I get out of here now, please? Can I go back to normal? Thank you. Thank you. So, what are you gonna do now? What do you mean? That shit with Mac. He's clearly lying, right? Learn more. I'm not sure what Mac's deal is. His story doesn't add up. Yeah. I do know that I need to find out exactly what happened that night. For myself and for Gabe. Bro, you seen what happened. Ryan, cut that hoe. I've got your back, no matter what. You seen what happened that Thank night. You. Ryan, cut that hoe. That means a lot. Now, I don't know about the phone call Mac thing was, the phone call thing Mac was talking I about. I should head back to work. Cool. She definitely won me. Even though the character a girl, she definitely won me though. Bye. Bye. This is the story of best friends, bro. The story of how best friends start. Now that we got the I friendship. know Gabe made that call. But did Mac really let the blast go off just to get back at him? Anyway, come on, let's go. What's going on downstairs, bro? I ain't gonna lie, we left him for a brick, bro. And they were heated. Anybody getting any fights? What happened? <clears throat> what? Where everybody at? Okay. Oh, hey, kid, you don't have to do that. Too late. I wanted to apologize for all of us. We're all grieving, but that's no excuse. It was your brother's wake, and you both deserve better than listening to a bunch of fools squabble. Squabble. Yeah, I appreciate that, Jit. I appreciate it. That was pretty rough. Although it's hard to imagine a good version of your dead brother's wake. No, there's no good version. Just all of us trying to get through it together the best we can. It wasn't the first wake held in this old building. I doubt it'll be the last. Anyway, if there's anything Why I can do, like just that? let me know. I need to talk to Mac. I know he's lying. I just don't know why. Any idea where I can find him? Well, he helps out Eleanor at the flower shop. That'd be the place to start. Thanks. Um, why am I looking for Mac? I exactly? feel like no, I should I warn you, lying, though. But like... You might not get the kind of closure you're looking for. If you get any at all. Just... 
Don't pin all your hopes on Mac Loudon. I mean, I could kind of guess that I was whooping any ass in the first episode, you feel me? Thanks for looking out for me, but what else am I supposed to do? I wish I had an answer for you. But if you get a chance before you go all dirty, Harry, swing by the dispensary. Charlotte wants to see you. And one more thing. What's going on? I've been meaning to give you this for the last few days. What, you want me to own the place? I didn't want to disturb you up there. Oh, oh. It'll get you through that door and the one upstairs. At certain times, okay. Ooh, I'm privileged. I'm privileged now, huh? This is your home now. The building key. For as long as you'd like. Yeah, I appreciate that, man. No, wait, yeah, wait! He, he did. I forgot. I gotta pay the bills now. Yeah, what about rent? Wait, hold on, man. What about rent? I don't want to be a freeloader. Man, can I? Don't worry about that for right now. Yes! We'll work out a way for you to earn your keep when the time comes. Ooh, thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Give him hell. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Damn. Bro made, made this spot. Bro, I, let me stay at this spot like I was going to pay no all the bills. I have no idea what to even say to him. Hey, that was terrible. You shouldn't have had to see that. I know you're going through a lot, but can we talk? I know it's asking a lot, but I really need to talk to you. Have it, bro. Let's see what he got to say. Let's see what he got to talk about, bro. All alone in this nasty little city, bro, with no Chick-fil-A around, bro. Great. <clears throat> bald! Hate bald niggas. Okay. Jed said I might find Mac in the flower shop. But I have time to swing by the dispensary if I want. I'll talk to Audi I'll talk to yeah. everybody else later, bro. Just let me get to that flower shop real quick. It's bullshit. We have a right to know what's happening to our jobs. Yep, yep never mind. Bald you guys don't think any something. Forget all that, bro. We gotta stay on track, bro. We'll talk to all of them later. We gotta get down to business though. <clears throat> um, hello, lady? Do you know her, uh, I forgot her name, Cindy or something is? The young lady? Blonde hair? Uh, about Eleanor? Yay, five, oh. <gasps> oh, that's the lady from the beginning! Sorry. Yeah. I forgot about her. No need to apologize. How are you, dear? Uh, oh. Could be better, but you know. I'm, living. um. Adjusting. Still just trying to adjust, I think. It's the wrong Give flower shop. Give yourself some time. Change is always hard. It's the wrong flower shop. So, uh, is um, Mac here? Yeah. That's yeah he was helping me not too long ago. I think he just left. Can't have gotten too far. Got it. Thanks. Oh, now, what was I? Hmm. that R. Is that R. What is the old lady thinking? She looks terrified. I can't leave her like this. Okay, time to figure out why she's afraid. Hey, this power, hey, I ain't gonna lie, I kinda slept on this power though. It's getting, it's getting a little better. Like we're getting, it feel like we're getting inside their minds, bro. The doctor said I had more time, but everything is becoming so out of order. Imagine someone getting in my mind, bro. Well, y'all probably see the craziest things. Or hear me think about the craziest things, bro. I feel like I think I thought about everything. Genuinely. All my memories are fading. Are fading. I, feel I feel broken. broken. Good? I think age is catching up to her. I ain't gonna lie. I feel like age is genuinely just catching up to her. Thank you, dear. 
I'll get started on it right away. Just come by with the check whenever you're free. If Riley, Riley finds, finds out. out. Oh, Eleanor, the mother of Riley. Oh, I did not she know that. Can't she can't find out. Find out about what? Find out about what? If they know if they about know my about condition, my condition, they'll make me close this place. She forgot what she was doing. She's afraid she's forgetting everything. Let me see how I can help. Forget what you were working on? <sighs> you could say I'm having a bit of a senior moment. <laughs> well, I can maybe I can help. Uh, trace your steps. Seems like you have a lot going on today. I think I'll sponge by finding his license. Help you retrace your steps. those steps. Come on. Oh, I'm, uh, I don't want to keep you. It's fine. I, trust me, lady. It's absolutely a okay. I ain't got nothing on my belt. Hey, I, I want to help. Why does it get so intimate? <laughs> okay. What would Eleanor have done first? Asking me, like I'm supposed to know. Like I'm Dora the Explorer. So I ask me what, what she does. What she does first? You were over here when I came in. Maybe you were counting the drawer. I would have done that last night. All right, when she first comes in the store, she gets the sign and she moves it to open. You must have flipped the sign to open. Yep, that's the first thing to do. I always flip it first thing when I come in, and then I open my mail. Uh huh. Something must have distracted me. Better. We can do this. You were over here when I came in. Maybe you were counting the drawer. Talk to me. That's all right. You don't have to do this. I'll be all right on my own. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. Did I get it right, though? Did you trim these flowers today? I don't remember. Get your ass on you. Over here, man. Come take a look. Now, hold on. Here we go. I don't even Could a phone call have distracted you? Yes. Yeah. I got a call first thing in the morning. Yeah. But I can't think who it was. Maybe we can find something to remind you. Every step retracer. Could it have been Riley who called? Yeah. I think that's right. She called to tell me about a new order. Uh huh. Goodness. What's the order for? Flowers! But the flowers is next. Oh, I'm locked in. The flowers! Rush order. This must be what Riley came in for. I think that order might have been for these lilies. Of course. Riley helped me pick them out before she left. Now we just have to figure out who ordered them. That way. That's the only last thing left. The check for the lilies would be in here, right? That could tell us who bought them. Should. Mr. Jedediah Lucan, huh. Oh, that's the, uh, bar dude. Looks like the lilies are for Jed. That's right. Riley dropped off an order for Jed. I knew you'd figure it out. I couldn't have done it without you. Seriously, Alex, you're a godsend. No, Jed that. must be hosting some event. I wonder why he wants lilies, though. They're traditionally for funerals. Oh. God. She doesn't remember. Oh, I thought she just didn't hear. Do I do tell her? I'm gonna walk up. They What's were... that gonna do? They were for Gabe's wake. Gabe's wake? Gabe. 
babes wake. I missed it. Well, I mean, I got a little video. Alex, I'm, I'm so sorry. Hey. It's, it's fine, it's fine. Excuse me. <laughs> She's gonna find out eventually, bro. Might as well should have let her know, bro. Okay. That sucked. But at least I told her the truth. My work here done. I just kind of ruined the old lady day. My bad. But it's okay, though. But now back to the main mission. She was more so sad that she missed him than Gabe just being dead in general. Eleanor said Mac ah. is nearby. I don't see him here. Maybe at the bridge? Oh. There we go. Mac. Yeah. Alex. Look, it's not a good time. You owe me an explanation about what happened to Gabe. I'm really sorry he died. And I appreciate that you, you didn't out me to Riley the other night, but I can't talk to you. Better start talking before I out now, nigga. Come on. I get it. He died on your shift and you're freaked, but you have to come clean. <sighs> Please. There's nothing I can tell you. Oh, nigga, there's something you can tell Matt, me, nigga. Come on. There's definitely something you can tell me now. Don't do that. He was my big brother. I can't. Last something definitely has him, him scared. Maybe if I could tap into his fear, I could get to Last the truth. Last interaction Mac had with Gabe, bro. That nigga was trying to fight, fight that nigga, bro. I just need to find something I could use to push him over the edge. Everyone's out to get me. Alex. Ryan, even Riley. Fuck! Even Riley? Did something happen with her? We're done here. Yo ass up, nigga. We ain't done, nigga. Right, where the hell Riley at? Where will Riley be? What's going on, little nigga? Hey, buddy. Hey, Alex. You okay, man? Are you doing okay? I'm fine. Shit, my fault. Bad for asking. Okay. Definitely not fine. Everyone needs to stop telling me it's okay. It's not. Fuck. Losing Gabe's been hard enough. Too bad I can't just run away from all this. Bro, where the hell is Riley at, bro? Bro, she's not in the flower shop. Where else would she be? She doesn't get around like that. Riley, where you at? I just need to find some. Uh, 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 uh. I just your wife loved wanted me. to see how you were Try doing. Uh, I'm straight, you know. Just living. I'm okay. Keeping my chin up. Sometimes that's all you can do. How about you? I can't even imagine what you're going through. Honestly, I'm really trying to keep it together for Ethan. He's that's hurting. Best. I ain't gonna lie, I did run into him at the park. That he does seem distant. That nigga, man, that nigga was a little upset. I ain't gonna lie. He practically just lost a father, but he's shutting me out. <sighs> he's never done that before, not when it mattered. He's a pretty insightful kid. He knows how much you're hurting, even when you try to hide it from him. Instead of trying to be strong, 
maybe the best thing you can do is show him that it's okay to hurt. Show him that you good, little nigga. It's all good. That's really helpful, Alex. Thank you. Just doing the best I can, you know, just doing me. I ain't no therapist, but, you know, doing the best. I can't get over the feeling that the one person who could help me deal with the aftermath of Gabe's death is Gabe. Dang, bro. That's sad. What is this? That's sad, bro. An affidavit from Typhon. If I sign, I'm agreeing not to press charges. In exchange for a payment. A big one. How big are we talking? How big are we talking? That's what I want to know. It's send Ethan to college big. Damn! Shit. Are you going to sign it? I don't know. I'm trying to put Ethan first, but... But? What would you do? Do you think it would be a betrayal of Gabe? Take the money for Ethan and turn the offer down. I do what you gotta do to help Ethan out at this point. You have to. I don't even wanna be that person, but you know. You have to put Ethan first. If the money helps, I think you should take it. Thanks, Alex. That means the world. That affidavit feels scummy, but Ethan should come first. I'm gonna figure out why Max lying. She said it's not betrayal. Still makes me feel sick. Same. Hey, she, do but... what you gotta do. Gabe would understand. Do what you gotta do. I ain't gonna lie. It's all up to you, though. Where the fuck Riley at? Steph asked me to swing by. She's gotta be around here somewhere. Yo, buddy. What's the breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. Damn. Ha! <laughs> yeah. Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but... Have you talked to Ethan at all? Talked is maybe too strong a word. I tried. He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. LARP. Like costumes, foam swords, that kind of thing? Yeah, but designed just Are for him about RP, and like Feynor. That RP thing in real life? Uh, I, I guess? Can we do that though? Can we even pull that off? It won't be high production value, but it'll still be fun. I need your help, oh, though. Make a Tubi I movie. want it to be as good as it can be. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? This already be so, as good as Tubi acting, What do you bro? think? Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? Great Kravis, the Lord of Underworld, Storm Rider, the Undead. Uh, I don't know. Uh, who look more badass? Who look like they would be like more fun to fight on some shit? Kravis look like he he on some like bending shit like something's coming up when he's putting his arms up and then storm rider look like he on some like lightning ass uh storm rider storm rider looks like a worthy opponent he gets my vote <laughs> all right then oh I, I gotta get back in there there's some stuff in my comp book be cool if you could check it out help me make some calls i'll see what i can do all right can we please find riley now bro we did all the side missions yo I never knew that! Hey, Riley. Alex. Hey. Uh... About Eleanor. You and Eleanor seem close. I thought that was your mom. She's taken care of me ever since I was little. I never really knew my mom, but... Oh. She's always been there for me. Okay. What does she think about you going away to school? She's thrilled. <laughs> I think she just wants me to end up happy. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. That's nice. That's nice. That's real. That's real that's nice. That's really sweet. She's the most selfless person I know. I know having you work with her in the shop has meant the world. Yeah. To both of us. Uh. No, Matt. Yes, that's what I gotta know about. That fight, Matt. Forget about everything else. I gotta know about Matt. Over your secret meetings. They were about you applying to college, right? Yeah. Ever since the first time Mac lost his shit in front of him. 
Gabe and Charlotte had tried to get me to end things with him. And after all this, I can see that they were right. Mm, so, you think Max telling the truth, though? Do you think he's telling the truth about the call? That Gabe never made it? No, I... I it's not that... I... Stutter, sorry. Stutter. What's going on? What's going I'm on? really not ready to talk about it. That's something they hiding, bro. Yeah, talking might help. Are you sure? We can get it out of here, bro. Sometimes no, they talking something. about it can help you sort it all out. Spill it, lady. Come on. I'm just not there Best yet. Up. Best up. Come on, bro. Talk. Talk. <laughs> I'm waiting. I know you and Gabe were close. How are you doing? I miss him so much. He was like an older brother to me. Well, he actually was an older brother than me. So, I'm glad he had you. I'm glad he had you. Thank you, Alex. Really, I gotta run. There's some stuff I need to do. So we did okay. all that. So you have the nerve to tell me. We did all this lurking and looking around, going through corner and creeps and corner, side mission, up, down, left, right, side angle, back, back, circle, square, man, up, up to the steps to the roof, down to the bottom of the thing, the dispensary, the flower shop. We find her just for her to not talk. We did all that for nothing, bitch. We just did all that for nothing. Bro, we literally just did everything. I don't want to push Riley, but I need to know more about Mac. How do I... No, what is this? How do I get her to open up? Figure out something. Oh, wait. I gotta wait. I forgot I have this. If he's innocent, why is he acting like this? Acting like what? Maybe I can get her to tell me. Do you... want to talk about Mac? Come yeah. On, we get straight to it. I get it. We went through all dialogues. It's just... If he didn't do anything wrong, why is he acting like he has something to hide? He asked me to leave Haven with him. What? Right after the ah. wake. He wouldn't tell me why, but he just looked so guilty. So Oddly, right after the way he wants to leave the city. I told him I had to think about it, but... Hmm. Alex, I... I gotta know a little bit about him. I'm scared. He did something horrible. Riley, thank you for telling me. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, you go to for that. You deserve the truth. We'll talk soon? Yeah, 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 yeah. Call me. Yeah. You got my note. Whenever you want. All right, now. Mac trying to skip town is sketchy as shit. Oh, loud. I bet I could use that to stoke his fear. Impressive. I'm pressing him. Still angry? Whoa, niggas, bro! Can't with him, bro. They always feel like they have to I do should the make most sure there's no nothing reason. else I want to no do reason. before I confront Mac. Oh, there's nothing else I want to do. I just want to confront the nigga. Come on. What Riley told me might do it, but I should make sure there isn't anything I still want to do around town first. What? There are a I'll few do things thing I want to do. I wish you could run faster, bruh. We don't got time for this light jog. Why is she... What the... Oh, she's geeking hard, bro. What in the... <laughs> bro, what? I ain't gonna lie, she off it. Ma'am? 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 Alright, never mind. Okay. Alright. Am I ready for this? Yeah, yeah, we ready for it, nigga. Ready. Okay. Let's do this. Come on. Drop the nuts. I got on. Riley to tell me about your plans to leave town. <laughs> That's not something innocent people do. Yeah. Oh God. It's not. I didn't do anything. Oh, really, buddy? You did it? Fuck off! Leave me alone! We on his ass. Oh yeah, we on his ass. Oh, we on his ass. What's that? Why am 
everybody looking at me. That's the lady that was geeking hard. What is happening? And you almost just crash paying this shit to me. Oh! Deal with Mac when I get to him. For now, I need to learn everything I can. Typhon's always watching. They run this whole town. Am I a Max Meyer right now? I'm in this nigga head, basically. That has to be it, because what is... What is this? I saw Mac run down that alley. Mac feels like everyone's staring at him. Everyone thinks I killed him. They all hate me. This is the sign I seen. What's, what's the thing behind it's this? Not it's not fair. I didn't do anything wrong. Riley? It should have been you instead. Oh! Alex? Oh, no. They actually all hate that nigga. No. What the hell? There are people out there! No, I told you to call it off! I saw the way they looked at me at the wake. They all think I let him die. I know why you're lying. I know you didn't mean for Gabe to get hurt, but you screwed up and it's time to come clean. I'm not the reason he's dead. I ain't even gonna say it's about revenge. Oh, it's gonna be down to it, isn't it? Typhon's forcing you to deny the call. Whatever you think you know. <laughs> well, I know some, all right. I know you tried to stop it. They fucked up, not you. Stop lying for them! You don't get it. This wasn't some accident. I told them you were down there, and they detonated anyway. On purpose? Why? I don't know. I swear. And then I get a message telling me to deny there was ever a call. You gotta believe me. Even I, we didn't get along, but I, I didn't want him dead. And now, now Typhon's watching me. My girlfriend, she, she thinks I'm a murderer? My neighbors all hate me? I mean, what, what, what the fuck am I supposed to do? Calm down. Just take a breather, my nigga. You can figure I this out. I think I can calm him down, but does he deserve it? Calm this nigga down, bro. Alright, I'm gonna calm him down, bro. I'm gonna calm him down. I'm gonna calm him down. Alright. Alright. Mac. Come on. Cause you gotta calm down, story, okay? Bro. Dude. We don't want. Stay with me. I don't wanna be the reason he tries anything. I know what it's like. So, we're gonna calm to him down. Alright? We're gonna calm this nigga down. To have everyone think the worst of you. But the truth will come out. I'll make sure of it. Alright? Got it. Typhon. If Typhon comes after you, they're gonna have to get through me too, okay? <sighs> Alright, lock in, nigga. Lock in. Usa. Usa. I actually feel a little better. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Yeah, well, you learn a thing or two hanging out with shrinks your whole life. <laughs> so. What are you gonna do now? Investigate. Don't leave Haven. I'm gonna get to the truth. We investigate. We investigate, alright? I think it has something to... Me personally, if I'm being honest with you, I genuinely think it has something to do with Ryan, bruh. 
That nigga's the only nigga I know. Bro, I visibly seen the nigga cut the rope. Like, he looked like he had, like, something out for him. No nigga would just do that. Who's just genuinely just gonna cut the rope, bro? Come on, gang. No one's doing that. No one's doing that. Hey. Yeah, it's... Can we talk? Where are you? Okay. Okay. Who we talking to? Ryan? That's who I really want to talk to about this whole situation, bro. Because I want to know about something. I ain't gonna lie, I genuinely do, bro. I want to know about something. There you go. The man himself. The man that cut the rope. You were right about Typhon, about Mac. Alex. Mac got the call. How do you know that? He got the call and he lied about it. Doesn't matter. Someone is putting pressure on him to keep quiet. Someone from the mine, and... It doesn't matter! Why are you getting all hostile behind it? I keep coming here and playing it back, but it always ends the same. Ryan. He's dead. He's really dead, this, Alex. My boy. Just saying. Super suspicious. located in how are we getting earthquakes let me look this up what state is the city it was Hayden my fault located? my job is to keep people safe connecticut and i failed we get earthquakes in connecticut oh typhon they did this you They're did amazing. everything right typhon took him away from us not you i mean you kind of did cut the rope but like if you didn't cut the rope she's wrong i let her cross that log i put gabe in harm's way I'm not a hero. I'm a coward. Worse than worthless. Neither of us is worthless. I, I know what it's like to feel worthless and helpless. You good, bro. Trust. But we saved Ethan. Trust me when I say this. You and you saved me. You good, bro. Trust. It doesn't right. matter. Gabe's dead. Because of me. Gabe. I'm so sorry. Let's lock in. Yourself, right? There's only oh, one person holding you responsible for this, Ryan. You need to forgive yourself. You ain't never gonna get over that shit. You're not if alone. You, if you like this, all right? You're a mess. I'm just letting you know that right now. You're a mess. All right? It's okay. It's all right. You good, bro. But come on, calm it down. We're gonna find out about this typhoon thing going on, and once we find out, we we gonna we gonna get things right. All right? All right? Sure. <laughs> Whoa, hold on. How do you go from crying to There's a guy in a gorilla suit? <laughs> Does he also jump fuck? off the cliff and into the pool? No, what is this no, whole story? What is this in a dialogue change? Suit. That guy jumps off the cliff and into the pool. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. This is a Mexican restaurant? Eh, nominally. <laughs> <laughs> the food is, uh, well, terrible. But it's Gabe's favorite place. <laughs> I tell you, he's the oldest 12-year-old I know. Damn, damn, damn. Can I ask you something? Of course. What's going on, man? You came up here to tell me that I was right about Mac, about him getting the call. How did you know? Um, uh, wait, wait, uh, you, you see, sometimes I get these intuitions and, you know, it, it, it just, um, you know. There's something... You should know about me. I, I, oh, and it's so going to be fine. easier to show fine, you than to me. explain it. We can read auras. This is going to seem sort of weird at first. Then really weird. I already just say she a mind reader. Reading aura me? sounds so ass. Think of something scary. What's scary? What's some scary stuff you can think of? Okay. Think of something that just scares the shit out of you. Really focus. 
until you feel it. Mac, Typhon, all of it. You're afraid you won't know how to handle it without Gabe. Imagine these type of, bro. I, I genuinely feel like these type of people like Alex be real, bro. Like, imagine someone knowing what I'm thinking all day. They might think I need jail time after some of this. Never shit. knew anyone. Not saying I think of nothing crazy, crazy throughout the day, but I swear I've thought of everything. Like, I, when I tell you I think of everything, I think of everything. So good at getting into and out of trouble. But I just, but the thing is, though, I know right from wrong, so that's why. I, <laughs> oh, man. This, I be thinking of this it. one time. <laughs> Whatever it is you're thinking about right now, don't stop, okay? Keep going. Okay. This nigga got the Super Saiyan glow around <laughs> What emotion is this? <laughs> what is it? What is it? What is it? <laughs> Say it. <laughs> Must be a good memory. I wonder if I can piece it together. Oh, that's a lot of blood, huh? Gabe, <laughs> this is serious. <laughs> Killing a Canadian goose is a violation of international law. <laughs> Shut up. It is not. They're Canadian geese, Gabe. <laughs> property of the crown. The... the crown of... Property of the crown, Gabe. What do we do? How deep you think? Deeper than that. The Royal Canadian Mounted Police can spot a goose grave at a hundred paces. <laughs> the Mounties? <laughs> oh, come on, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. How long were you going to let me dig? <laughs> I wasn't going to stop you. <laughs> okay. Shovel flashbacks. I guess T. That's Gabe. T. Goose. I see it. It'll move. It's not moving. It'll move. Wait, that's a goose? Gabe! <laughs> oh, nigga almost ran over so, a goose. <laughs> did you finish burying the goose or not? <laughs> okay, also, property of the crown. <laughs> Really? <laughs> well, they are technically protected under the Migratory Bird Treaty Act. <laughs> How? I'm that so raven, nigga. Basically. So, I guess I have this power. I can see other people's emotions. They show up like an aura, and if I get too close, I... I feel what they feel. Mm -hmm. As if I was feeling it myself. Mm -hmm. And when I focus, I can even understand why they're feeling it. Mm -hmm. Talk to them. And that's what you just did with... with me? Nah. I was just giggling to giggle. Some kind of power. No kidding. It's, you me that's it's raven, only man. ever been the bad emotions before. But that... That was pure joy. Who else knows? Enjoying moment, Gabe. 
Gabe did, but now I guess just you. And that's how I know Max terrified of Typhon. He reported Gabe's call and they ignored it. Now they're putting pressure on him to toe the line. Okay, but why? I don't know yet. Someone made the decision to let the blast go off. Seems like finding out who would be a good start. So you're going after Typhon? Basically, yeah. I don't you don't know need who help. They are. I don't know if it's a business. I don't know who this is. But we gotta find out who it is, though. You don't have to. I'm gonna tell you that. You're stuck with me now. This nigga trying to flirt. Give him a hug, girl! Come on, don't be shy around it, nigga. Yeah. You're welcome, I guess. Yeah. Thanks. Thank you. No. Thank you. Okay. 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 This one's for you, Gabe. I miss you. Is she the one singing that? How do I change? How do I go? How do I know? Uh. I didn't speak this morning. I couldn't. Hearing everyone talk about him, about the life he had here with all of you, I lost uh -huh. the chance to have that. I'm Bob with his beat. I'm listening, but, but even I'm though I only had one day with him, dang, that's actually sad. He changed though. my life. That's sad if you genuinely think about the whole dialogue of this. From the foster care, from her not seeing her brother for how long, then she moves with the nigga, and then after one day of seeing the nigga, he dead. That's sad, bro. I ain't gonna lie, that's actually sad, bro. <laughs> I said, I didn't know if I belonged here. Yeah, there's no Chick-fil-A. But, hey. He told me. I'm kind of liking the people around That home now. isn't something you find. Mm. It's something you build. Mm. I love you, Gabe. LLG, man. LLG. Flat butt ass nigga. Why is she the negative Nancy? What's going on with her? Mm. Alex... Calm the Mac down out from his panic attack. Alex reminded me about what happened. Charlotte signs her phone. Uh, her money. Uh, Alex didn't send it in the dock. Hey, most of my choices were good though, bro. Damn, 6%! Alex didn't look through Steph's comp book. Was I supposed to? Hey, majority of things though, I did. I feel like I did the right thing, bro. I ain't gonna lie. W third episode, bro. W third episode, W third episode, W third episode. So now we found out a little things now. Typh Typhoon is the reason them rocks came flying down that mountain at that time. Apparently Mac works for that building, you know. They didn't tell him anything. He said that we were up there. Obviously they didn't care. I don't even know who Typhoon is for real. But, you know, as time goes on, we gonna find out, bro. I ain't gonna lie. As time goes on, we're gonna find out. Alright, Fish Worldwide to the end of time, and I'm gonna see you on the next episode.